Well, it might be Monday, but at least the sun is shining. It's warming up a little bit nicer out there. We're off to a pretty good start when it comes to the work week. Let's turn things over to our KDK meteorologist Kristen Emery for the details on this forecast. And I like how you mentioned before, hey, we're going to drop down in temperatures eventually this week, but it's not going to be too shocking. Not too shocking. I mean, the lowest temperatures we have for the seven day forecast in the lower 20s and some of those will be hitting tonight north of I 80. So it'll be a cool night tonight, but we're getting a little bit milder as we head into the start of March tomorrow. Right now you see that nice sunshine, a little bit of high thin cloud cover in spots, but you can see we're at 34 degrees in Pittsburgh. Slight bit of a wind chill, light wind out of the north northwest at five miles per hour. Cold front dropped through here last night, cooled us down a bit and gave us those breezy cool temperatures yesterday. Now we're starting to recover. We're up to 34 in Cranberry, 36 Beaver Falls. We're up to 37 in Waynesburg, Morgantown, 38. So we'll start to see those temperatures really take off tomorrow. Today they'll stay in check a bit up to about 42 by four o'clock for Pittsburgh's high and you see most sunny skies, little cloud cover rolling in tonight ahead of some rain chances midweek. So if you want to get the grime off the car, the salt car wash forecast, today's your day. We're looking at sunshine today, dry conditions tomorrow. Pretty good up until around 3 or 4 p.m. Then we have a slight chance for a few showers Wednesday evening. The best chance all week that we'll have some widespread showers. Here's that cold front I mentioned dropping south of the area. Now the warm sector of this system is going to waft across our area later tonight, tomorrow, but you also see this moisture. It's snow showers up over the Western Great Lakes, but by the time this drops down into our area, it'll mostly be a few rain showers tomorrow coming into that warmer air. So here's six o'clock this evening. Clouds begin to roll back in. Enjoy this afternoon. Beautiful sunshine, comfortable temperatures tonight. Not too bad temperatures in the lower to mid 20s. And then tomorrow we start off very warm but dry. Here come a couple of showers. Here's two o'clock. Watch these sprinkles move in. Good chance into the laurels and ridges, maybe into southern eastern Fayette County by late afternoon. We get a couple of showers, but that's about it. Say a sprinkle or a shower and then overnight that cold air starts to uh, filter back in and we could see this end as maybe a few wet snowflakes in spots trying to mix in won't amount to anything because we'll be back into the 50s on Wednesday. Dry through the day Wednesday, but watch what happens Wednesday night. Here's another trough of low pressure, widespread showers ending as a few wet snowflakes mixing in as we head toward early Thursday morning. So 42 and sunny today, seven day forecast, 55 Tuesday, 53 Wednesday, couple of sprinkles possible Tuesday afternoon, evening, Wednesday night. The best chance for showers, maybe a few wet snowflakes mixing in Thursday behind that front. We're back down to 39, but lots of sunshine. And then we start to recover again Friday, mostly cloudy, but 45 and check out the first weekend of March 58 Saturday. And yes, a few showers, but how about 65 for Sunday, Lindsay?